Shout out to the ball heads. Shout out to the ball heads, Scalawags. Period. Your favorite duo. Your favorite duo. I'm in the ready. building. Back again. With another one. With another one. Yeah. 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 Shot, yeah. See a shot, take a shot. Cut. See a shot, take a shot. You know, everybody toast. Toast to this, to this mm -hmm. good shit. We got planned. We ain't gonna tell y'all just yet because y'all be still shit. Mm hmm. Mm. You know yeah. who he is. Mm hmm. Mm. Yeah. Yup, y'all be still. He does. Damn, that was good. But if you don't know, now you know. This is Keeping It 100 Talk Show. And we the best podcast in the building with your favorite duo. Mm -hmm. And it's your girl. Southside 100, the label with all the flavor. And you already know, it's your girl, Kelly Cash, and that's Cash A with a K. Because I like it my way all day, every day, baby, baby. You know? And you yeah. already know, it's your boy Greedy, shorts man around. Wake you your ass the fuck up! Yeah, you gotta wake up. You gotta wake up. Because we already ain't seen you in the few weeks. Yeah. And stuff. Right. That, First you of know, all, all right. you do your, you do your ish like that. Do your show First, like that. You ain't gonna do our show like that. You gonna do your, do your show like that. We're gonna have we to don't do like that. We're gonna have to So we're gonna run it back from the uh yeah. It's yeah. your girl Kelly Cash and that's Cash with a K because I like it my way all day, every day, if I swear from boom. Here you go. Yeah, here you are. Who we got in the building? Who we got? You Who already know, man. It's your boy Big Greedy in the building. Hey, it's all right. Know. Shortest man around, but I'm gonna take a girl. Yeah, you period, already know. Period. How we doing tonight? How we doing? We doing good tonight. We all a little drunk. A little drunk at home. We always gonna be a little drunk. Always gonna be a little hungry. Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 I like to eat. I feel like cooking. Shout out to Diddy and Revolt. What you cooking? Cause you see us. I don't what, know what, you. Yeah, what is you cooking? I don't know you. Cause we got good groceries. I feel like it. You know what? I like a man that cook. My man don't cook, but I like a man that cook. Okay, well, would you rather have a man that cook or sing? What turn you on? I can sing myself. Ah! Thank you. Period. You cook, I'll sing to you while, while you, you cook. cook. <laughs> you know what? It's you know the, what? Hold on. It's your favorite duo. That's trifling as hell. It's drinking. Let me get a water bottle. Uh oh. Yeah. Y'all want to slip that? You know. Can I get one? You got one here? Yeah. Mmm. Yeah. Hit it kind of hard there. Yeah. See, y'all don't need no more. You the pro. But yeah, so earlier in the week, we put a poll up. I put a poll up. Mm -hmm. And the poll was basically saying, long story short, I ain't going to read it, but dude was saying he did a move with his homeboy for 20 years. Yo, ace. Yo, day one, it's your 20-year homeboy. Y'all did a move. During the move, you know, mm -hmm. he had a pistol. Homeboy had a pistol. And we know how the moves go. You feel me? If you know, then you know. If you know, you know. But <laughs> they eventually got caught up in the move. Mm. I gotta sneeze. Here's where the story gets interesting. <laughs> so when they got caught up in the move. Mm, that was type of bougie ass, cute that was was that. <laughs> It was cute. <laughs> you heard me think, oh, that's cute. <laughs> I'm sorry, things like that. A chew, a chew. Not a chew, bitch. A chew. Mm -hmm. Got to put the M on the end. A chew. Mm -hmm. But anywho, mm -hmm. you heard it here first. Heard it here first. It's the chicken salad. It's so stupid. Get you one. Get you one. But yeah, Skybox so, Deli. <laughs> Super. <laughs> the Skybox Deli. Yeah, you talking about? But yeah, when they got caught up. Oh, shout out to the drink. It's drinking. right. It's, it's drinking. When they got caught up, wow. Homeboy, day one of 20 years, tosses his pistol in. Oh, boy, look. Hey, look, officer, this is my gun. And now he's <laughs> mad that he, so basically, oh, boy got two options. He facing 30 years for both, for both weapons, in position of both weapons, along with the move. Now, that 30 could get dropped to 15. Listen, here's me. My name is Kelly Cash. <laughs> if you tell uh, me, YSL so. is not a record label. It's it a game. <laughs> <laughs> if you tell me, folks. So what made See. me put the poll up? I asked my dude, and this nigga was like, "I guess I'm gonna run in thirty out." You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna wake up. You gonna do it? You gonna ride out what? Yeah, he 
He's not riding out. I'm just saying. I'm not riding out. I'm singing like a canary. Do you hear me? Hello. You said singing for the back. Hello. Look, officer. I got this. My four five. What are you talking about? I don't know about them. These yeah. my drugs. But what's so crazy? Know about that. <laughs> the cherry on the top is after he tossed the pistol in his homeboy lap. He got the, out of out the police car. Uh, not out of the police car. But he got out of the car with his hands up and said, "I ain't got nothing. Y'all can let me go." <laughs> Fuck that. Both of these yeah. guns is your honor. I am. I was held hostage. That nigga. He told me that if I didn't sit in this motherfucker, you see I'm in the passenger seat. You see I'm in the this passenger nigga seat. told me if I didn't, if I didn't, if I got up, he was gonna shoot me. I had to live for my kids. I had me to live in me. the passenger seat. But what, I, oh, see, what right. the fuck? I'm gonna this? put this right back in your. Seat. This his car. It, it's I'm registered to him. I was. I'm gonna, well, I, I was. I'm gonna put that bitch right back in Hello? your seat. Look me up. And I'm, I'm gonna touch you with my shirt, nigga. What? You can have that. I feel like it's only snitching. If you tell on a motherfucker behind a back and that was the plan and you just had no motherfucking clue. But if I'm telling on your face, it's snitching and it's telling. I'm telling. I'm telling on you. Like, I ain't telling on you. Because I, I ain't doing nothing behind your back. You feel me? I, I, I'm, 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 tell, I'm telling so hard. I'm telling on your face. You, I, it was hers. It, it, you feel me? That bitch put us in the room. I only know about that black 4 5 right now. That's all if I know. I about. learned nothing from 48. I learned when a nigga drop his head with a but he snitching. When a nigga hit that, God damn. Hey, bro, so don't look. eat the food. Did my if, they, if they offer you some chips, say no. That's how they get your DNA. Did my phone five? You can run the fingerprints on the other one. I did not touch that gun. Don't drink the water, sir. Don't drink the water. Hold on, y'all got some M&M's. Let me, let me tell you where it started. So, boom, on Friday, he called me, right? Murder. Look, you got time. On Friday, he called me. He told me, come ride with him real quick. He said, no. buddy, fuck this baby mama. He was tired of this shit. No, I'm, just <laughs> I'm just saying. He had a bag up under the bed. <laughs> he said he had an extra yeah. clip at the grandma house address. Right. 25 Glenwood Avenue. Matter of fact, and the auntie stay on Mathis. Right around the corner from her my name, Susan. She fucking a nigga named Lil John. His hey, side bitch about. and you, baby mom. I know them both. I follow him on Instagram. Hey, you talking about fat ass too, baby? <laughs> <laughs> nah, but I'm it. snitching. <laughs> Cause that. I'm not doing no time for nobody. Fuck that. Nobody. Right. And then. And I'm gonna sit. I'm gonna sit my ten years after I snitch. Not even just doing even no time for nobody. Just. Like for people who be gung ho. Like, well, I'm just not. I'm just not no snitch. What has the game done for motherfuckers for you to do huh. jail time? Just for you to be in jail for a lifetime? Just for you to say I ain't I ain't snitch? Bitch, fuck you. Any I'm, real nigga I know who did snitch regret that shit. No, real shit. Real shit. Real you, shit. You say it's shit. Especially yeah. when you find out, like, when you get that discovery pack, you be like, damn, nigga. That nigga told on me. How the fuck? Right. If I would have known that. Niggas that don't snitch. <laughs> it was the head <laughs> drop. <laughs> snitch don't. He boy, I know about that, that, boy. That get snitch. Like, the one you boy. least expect. You have one minute left. Nigga. <laughs> damn. <laughs> Now how your conversations be going? Hey, you talking about like dead ass. But what what the I'm on the recorded phone calls. Well, that motherfuckers shit. don't fail to realize, like you said, the discovery tell you everything, everything. down to a motherfucker, down to a motherfucker social security number. Dead ass, down to a motherfucker social security number. They think you can't find them. You can't find nobody behind that wall. They need to stop doing that shit. They, nah. Real. They do that shit the on thing purpose. about it is they can't because that's literally how your discovery repair is supposed to be. Um, it's supposed to be all the information in there on where this person lived and how they was able to see just this Just in case crime. they got to call them up. So and this is my thing though, right? Your, your house got to be in the same area so as the crime. So when you find all that out, what you do with that information? Whatever needs it's uh, necessary. I mean, exactly, whatever. What you do with that information? <laughs> do you ride or do you ride? <laughs> Both. That's how a lot of witness tampering goes on. Goes on. But we ain't gonna speak up too much, cause right. We know but how APD do. All I want to know is, 
Gunner, did you snitch or did you, uh, did you not? Because now all your homeboys are starting not to fuck with you. And I was trying to have your back for a second and shit because you made your statements and your lawyer did. But so Wham unfollowed you, dirt chumping your ass Ufo off. Ufo said, leave him alone. He's a snitch. <laughs> Future said, Gunner is the new six nine. That's how. That's what it's getting. Him and him and six nine might as well make a collab that's called Snitch. Shout out to that boy Ufo. That that that's what it's getting. They might as well. I, I, hey, shout out to y'all AR team. And if y'all do that, I need my cut. Cause yeah, and then y'all need a group. Like, when he took that picture and made that, you know, made his last little uh, post on Instagram, folks was like, "Well, he's still claiming why I said that nigga's on the contract." I wouldn't claim that shit. Hey that man, under, look, that look. you can claim whatever, label, but do they claim the you? Though. But do they claim you? Shout out to Club Lawyer from taking him thirty six charges down to eight. You know, cause nah, cause he was a beast. Shout out to Club Lawyer. He was a, I, hey, he was a beast. You do child support cases? I mean, you know, shout out to me, cause, cause <laughs> I got a case. I need you know help. I mean? Hey, you come out. <laughs> no, but I thought um. Thug, like, Uncle said, leave him alone. Okay, so it's Uncle and Thug, brother. Uncle and Thug, brother. Yeah, blood related. But I thought he the one who said, leave Gunner alone. He did. Gunner still YSL. He did. That's what oh, I was that's like, what shout out to Uncle. Oh, okay. Shout out to that boy. Uncle said, leave Gunner alone. He still game. But what's up with goddamn got it all lame man my mama said don't speak my brother name it fuck you and your mama bitch like that's, that's, how, that's how niggas came off no i'm <laughs> saying that's how niggas came off leave, that my mama said leave key that leave key that key like, dead though right like nigga like you can't put key in there and then key dead and then but i mean you, why not it like i mean i feel i feel him on that leave key out of yeah. bro no got the key no, dead. No, no, no he was really responding Really throwing shots to Gunner when Gunner had said, you know, rest in peace, Key. I love you. I miss you, twin. Then got it gonna post. Don't call me twin. First of all, nigga, he wasn't talking to you. He wasn't. Like, like you, you he didn't say nowhere. Got it is the got it is the homeboy that want to be included. Got it is the two letter word. Got it is the homeboy that want to be included. Like you from we all from the south side. You know these niggas personally. You know got it was the little brother that just wanted to be included. Nigga, we ain't even too. Tootsie is is on the charts more than got it, and we don't even listen to him. Hey, I listen to Tootsie. I, I like Tootsie. the little Tootsie roll, but that's about it. You mean no, no? I like Tootsie. 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 No, I don't. Tootsie, Tootsie. 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 fine. Yeah, Tootsie. 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 Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm not too much of a fan. I mean, I'm not. I like the Tootsie roll song. You feel me? Even though they just took the whole the whole song. Song, yeah. you know, let me I like the song, but yeah. I ain't never. But to be honest, I didn't know what the whole Southside YSL like. I've never been a fan, honestly. I hate to say it, but I knew of Key songs, but before Key died, I was like, oh, that's, that's all his shit. Yeah. Like that's Key. Oh, that's who little Key did. I'm not a fan of the South Side YSL side. Like I just, I just heard about. Well, I been knew about these niggas in the street, but as far as like they music and shit, I ain't never been a fan of like the South Side slime side. That's why I said like Tootsie, like the Tootsie Roll song is the first song and only song I know. Damn. A Tootsie, and I've always known Lil Got It as Key bro, Lil Brother, but that's. You know, we from the South Side, the Clayton and the Fulton side. So it's just like yeah. it was always the little homeboy that just wanted to be included. And you know I ain't lying. And this is my show, so I can say what the fuck I want. And who gonna check us? Nobody. Your favorite duo. And if you already haven't, like, mm -hmm. share, mm -hmm. comment, subscribe, and hit that notification mm -hmm. bell like you ain't forgot. Mm -hmm. And Zeus! Mm -hmm. You see us. You see us, because you ain't got no podcast show now. You no. see us. But... Have y'all seen that bad? It's what's true. No. I ain't watched the chick. I think it was supposed to come out tonight at 8 or something. Well, so, are y'all a fan favorite of anybody on the baddies? I, I thought I was going to fuck real. with Tommy. So, no, honestly, Tommy getting on my nerve. Honestly. Tommy on her? Yeah, she is. And I, I feel like that was kind of like... Okay, honest opinion. Because like you said, it's our show and y'all not going to check me on it. Zeus, it's just my personal opinion. No offense to y'all casting. I feel as though Suki and Tommy should have been left on the auditions. That's oh, just how Suki I feel. On, Suki on the season two? 
So you said that Susie with the good coochie. Yeah, she was with them on a for no. a couple of. I don't know. She's on there the whole time, but I know she was there for a certain moments. The reason why I right. don't like Tommy being on there, and there's nothing against Tommy. She's a beautiful girl, and she just a typical hood chick. Yeah, but if, if you've watched Tommy from Love and Hip Hop up until now, and I follow her in her. Celebrity. That whole jumped on that nigga like a spider. I you know, <laughs> reality TV ain't for her because it, it, it brings her that. Like she does so good when she's not in front of the camera, but it's when the liquor gets involved. The liquor, and you know they gonna put liquor. They, they gonna push. They liquor, gotta. Period. They gotta do the liquor. Yeah, if they don't do liquor, it's gonna be boring. And I feel but like my whole thing is. Down. When we gonna when we gonna overcome this fighting shit in the back? Like, it's so much more to that shit. And that's another reason why I'm mad at Tommy and shit. And even Natalie. Natalie, I get it. Hoes fighting is entertaining. Entertaining. But bitch, you old enough. Just she stay behind the scenes. Hands. Just stay behind be the scenes. Be a baddie scenes. off camera. Like, be a baddie off camera. We too old to be goddamn. Yeah, just run the show. Like, bro. just just fighting be everywhere we go. Show. Like, you're supposed yeah, to. Like, you, how about like you're supposed to. That's that. That's what I'm saying. Like you gotta know when to hang up your heels. That's just like banging for niggas. Like you gotta know when to hang your chucks up, nigga. Yeah. Like you can't bang forever. Yeah. You still gonna be the OG, bro. You gonna be the OG. We gonna always respect you in the street. We gonna always know who you are. We gonna always. You feel me? But yeah. You gotta stop that. Like you gotta let that shit go. And then you don't even drop no. Like, even with your baddie reunions, you don't. You don't even drop no show saying the good shit that the motherfuckers is doing. Like, they real motion and shit. Remember how, remember how, like, that old Super show, broke, remember Charm show, School? Oh, 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 How they took all the girls from, like, Flavor Love and all yeah. them. But Monique was trying to, you feel me, teach them how to be ladies, teach mm-hmm. them how to be business. We need a Charm School, like, though. We need another Charm School. Mm-hmm. You know, and that was VH1, but... Zeus, you Lamel, heard us. You hear us. Lamel, whatever your name is, not so trying to tell what your name is. Dark you see my DMs. Dark Hold on. You but you see my DMs, and I no sh- disrespect to your wife because I make sure I send the appropriate shit. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But, but you, you see, see us. You and see us. And I don't appreciate being And I know you got a lot, but we don't hit you every single week. Every week. I don't, every like, week. I don't like being in You don't get a pin every single episode. Keeping it 100. It was a smooth way you did that, too. On your business. That was smooth. Yeah. That was real smooth. But when we come up with our own network, don't say nothing hmm. when it's competition. Because hmm. y'all not going to keep ignoring us, Revolt and Zeus. Because no. you see us. you going to see us. Yeah. And we come hard. I'm going to call a lot of shit remote. <laughs> but you know what? Anyway, in anyway. water. Out. Right. Drowning y'all. Ass. Drowning so, you bitches. On the latest episode of Blueface and Krishan, your cousins. Shout out to the toxic couple. They tried to resolve the problems from the fight with the mama and the sister. Now, Janice, you got beat up. Yeah, let that go. Let, let, let's start there. It's okay. We all take an L sometimes. You, that was one L you took. Okay, whether it, whether you thought uh, most of the hits came from the boys or most of the hits came from her. Overall, you got beat up. So, I'm going to need you to just take that L. And just, you know, it'd it be like that. It'd be like that sometimes. Just like when Kashawn lost her too. That was, that was an And she wears her. that proud. And she wears that proud. And his baby mama saying? did that. Yeah, I, I, I know. But. Still fuck with her to this day. And, okay. Sidebar. Is this the same baby mama that you took them Christmas pictures with? Yes. Would you continue. Okay, so tell Would me. you continue to still deal with the nigga? Even though, okay, I you get the kids. The I get, I get, your, you got to be a father to your kids. But would you still deal with a nigga who is that happy-go-lucky with his baby mama after you know she not my motherfucking too far? <laughs> but respectfully, okay, boom, in his defense, in his defense, he did not. The girl popped up on that shit, like, Okay, boom. It was it was one of our situations. Mm-hmm. I got the drop. Mm-hmm. I'm coming to whoop your ass. Mm-hmm. But you don't know I'm coming. Just so happened, I slide your shit so hard, you hit the ground, your two fall out. Now, was it a fair one? Eh. Eh. 
yes, no, maybe so, a little bit, not really. But Krishan fight like a dude. Yeah. So I in his defense, too far too. yeah, in his defense, it wasn't person like yeah, and like I said, it depends on how good the dick is. Yeah. But also on the his on the notion of in his defense, and I don't defend him a lot. But in that last ass whooping you gave Krishan. I got your back on that one, and I don't condone domestic violence, but I ain't gonna hold you. If a motherfucker hit me, that see that was a reaction ass whooping. That was the after the Hennessy, after she bopped your head up top, after she bopped your ass with that Hennessy bottle. That was the reaction ass whooping. I'm sorry, Krishan. That was that reaction ass whooping. Like I, I can imagine how it happened. And say, oh shit, bitch, I'm finna motherfucking beat your ass. But, yeah, that's how it happened. I don't condone domestic violence, but that 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 one. I'm sorry, Kashan, bro. You had that one coming, bro. That nigga was leaking for a couple of days. That nigga was in and out in the, the other motherfucking episode. They was like, wake up, bro. Y'all want to go to the hospital? I'm straight. I'm straight. No, nigga, you have a concussion. <laughs> yeah. I was like, no, bro. Take your ass to the hospital. Take your ass to the hospital, nigga. You was nigga, you need stitches. Thank you. Yeah. Stop my staples in that man's head. Hey, no, man. Look, look. That was what I mean. Like, we is, black. Is, is that, does that mean that we even? Yo, baby mama knocked out my tooth and I bushed your head over. I, I think so. I think we fair. I think, I think so. We yeah, even. You up. took that lick for your baby mama. Y'all won. Yeah. I'm finna beat yeah. your ass. Yeah. I, yeah. <laughs> I ain't gonna hold you. If on the sister tip, let a bitch bust my brother outside. Oh shit. With a bottle. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm gonna shoot your ass. Like, tell it and all. Like, I'm, I'm, just saying, I'm just playing probation officer. But if you know, you know. But, um, yeah, that was one of them. I don't condone domestic violence, but baby. And then, bro. I was what? on the episode looking like motherfucking goddamn. You, you remember? She looked like Natalie did when she got her ass beat by no, us. What's her no, name? It was, a, it was oh, a little man. worse. Remember the hunchback of Notre Dame? Remember how his funny. face used to be? Yeah, that I was like, bro. And then the motherfucker kept saying, "I would have kept them glasses on." Why did you take the Why glasses off, off, my nigga? Wow. That's like, that shit that, hurt. I know it did. He beat but, your ass. So. As far as sure is, the sure. conversation with, you know, the mom and the sister and all that stuff, I feel where the brother was coming from. You get what I'm saying? But even, it's a, I can't, it's an even one. You beat up my, you beat up my, you beat up my mom, my, my daddy don't jump on you. Okay, it's an even one. But I ain't gonna hold you. No matter what the fuck I'm going through with my mom, ain't nobody finna put no hands on my mom. You know, you might get, I nah, ain't nobody coming for my sister neither. But I'm gonna let my sister fight. Nah, fuck all but that. Ain't man, man, hands fuck all that. Man, fuck all that. Fuck all that. Fuck all that. We gonna call wrong for wrong. That's a grown ass woman. That girl is a grown ass woman. You are not gonna throw shit at me. Yeah. And think I'm not gonna. I don't give a fuck yeah. who mama you is. And bitch, you I know that. Have checked my mama. When you got that washing machine, I, yeah. you yeah. I feel you. He should. But have at, in his that mama. moment, he, he, he couldn't. Yes, he could have. In that moment. In that moment, no, you couldn't. Let's be for real. I me. would have checked my mom. Me, somebody and don't I say, would have took my bitch out of the situation, but I would have checked. I don't give a fuck how wrong my mama do. Ain't nobody putting their hands on my motherfucking mom. Period. Like you I said, don't it's a reaction. Way. It ain't intentional. I, 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 you can't go from the girl. Like if you listen to the shit, the, and he, he even said it. She was defending the mama at first. I get that. So. When you, I'm defending the mama you. was wrong. Wrong as fuck. You throw something at me, mom. I'm sorry. Like, wrong. shout like, out to he should have listen. checked his mama. His like, mama, his mama shouldn't have threw shit. Period. Yeah. The at mama, the end of the day, the you a grown was, ass the woman. The mama was wrong. And I if, get that. And if the if they decided to break up tomorrow because he beat you the fuck up, at the end of the day, facts still remain. You shouldn't have threw shit at that girl. You're right, but at the beginning of the day, facts shit. That's, that's my still mama. somebody mama. I well, that, that's, yeah. But if that's the case, it's because, still my daddy. Because I, I beat your mama up. up, you beat my daddy no. up. We fair. Fuck that. <laughs> It no. was two weeks apart, all, sister. All the shit that my kids go through, that. they coming for they they coming for a motherfucker about me. I ain't no, saying that they ain't, but like I ain't saying that they ain't. They 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 you know what I'm saying? I'm saying that they ain't. I can't look, stand look, my mama look. had ninety percent, ninety eight percent. Look, 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 look. That's how I feel, man. But you ain't coming. I I'm gonna come for my mama for sure. And look, I feel you. I would have been wrong. I would have 
would have bucked my mama or pushed my mama, but I'm not finna close hand nothing. And I'm not finna let nobody close hand nothing, my mama. And even though, and, and Janice, here's where I'm mad at you about why you trying to be all friendly, friendly and shit because you got beat up. I don't give a fuck if you get beat up seven motherfucking times. Me and Krisha would have been hitting every time I seen her about my motherfucking mama. I don't give a fuck. But Krisha, here's why, here's why you ain't doing it. If you would have won, you would have had that energy. If you know for facts that girl just beat your ass, you ain't hopping in the ring with that Ooh. bitch no more. Yes, I am. I'm saying about my mom. You, sure. her. Obviously, you scared. I'm not being buddy, but a real bitch ain't being buddy buddy with no hoe. Especially if you beat me up. I gotta win at least one time before I say anything to you. Period. That's why I said all that fake ass shit. All this little Period. fake ass conversation shit. Fuck all that shit. Despite our fight, you feel me? The point I'm making is, I'm going to fight you every time for my mom. Like, period. I don't give a fuck if I win the next one. If I think about you here, my mom, we fighting again. We fighting again. I'm sorry. Th- think about twin. I don't give a fuck what you and twin going through. Somebody go against mom. We all, we all on the south side. We all we, and, and you know, your mama, my mama, and especially your mama, wrong at all motherfucking times. But at the end of the day, and... I can't see what I'm saying. I know her mama is. We, we come. So, goddamn. I, I know her mama is. So she I is. trust me. I, that my mama done like, put that restraining like, orders on motherfuckers. My mama done called the police on my closest. My mama done tried to lock all our ass up. Oh, God. So but, I'm like, shit. Mom's spelling and all. I'm, I'm, I'm talking about it. That's why I'm like, shit. And the heat but, of the moment. But, but, and the heat of the moment, it just depends on. It just depends on the circumstances on if your significant other got respect. Got and he don't have no, but he don't have no respect shit. for his mama. So you know, so so you can't which expect for him to, to make his bitch have respect for his mama <coughs> if he don't have no respect. Okay, which is why he treat Krishan the way that he do because he don't have no respect for women at all. Exactly. So which goes to the second fight between them. You mad that he called you a bitch, bitch? You know he don't have no respect for his mama, like you said. So how do you expect him to have respect for you? I'm just gonna treat so, you like a bitch. So if you want to call me a bitch and you want to be acting, you know, doing little bitch shit, we gonna hook like bitches. Yeah, I mean, now if you end up getting your ass beat in the process, Krishan, you can't hide in the Lambo. And his shit, and his and his shit. I see. I just want her. Not you hit in the Lambo. It was bringing yeah. her own shit. Yeah. You're at the point right talking. now that you can boss up with you your own it. crib. Now. You can boss <coughs> up with your own car. Yeah, she could. Like, you can boss up on your and own. And Zeus, y'all right should have did that. Why y'all giving her shows and shit? And y'all think, y'all thinking that shit y'all cute. Get y'all getting idea. ratings off that shit. Y'all should have got that girl more a place to live. Bossing her ass Yeah, up. and gave that girl like, a fucking car and really making her shit on this nigga. Like, yeah, you could be with a nigga all day and like long, but you ain't got to live with that own. nigga. Exactly. You, you don't have, have to live with that nigga. Shit. Live with that nigga when he know how to treat you like you're supposed to live with that nigga. Otherwise, blue face give me, you supposed to be my rich side nigga, period. At, period. Like, but she knows that. That's why she be making little, you don't be hearing the little slick comments like, if I really go for to the to the rich niggas that's really on my motherfucking line. She be making them little comments. She knows she got rich niggas on her line, but, but she's so stuck it. on this nigga. You know, the dick is good. Dick is good. That, it got to be. That dick is good. And that's that, the only I'm thing they boil down to. That shit got to be. I'm, I'm convinced that. <laughs> I'm talking about that. You, that you be guapping that thing, don't you? So you ain't got to answer it because I know. I seen the sex tape. It didn't exist. It wasn't like that, that. It wasn't that juicy, but it, you don't know. It could have been more where that came from. It, that might have been I, a bad night. But that might have just been a quick. The, the one in she the car. Mad. No. Oh, I seen the one in the car. Oh no, I saw the one on them with the couch. It was sitting on the couch. She was sitting on that thing like this. Oh, I seen. Oh. Oh, I, I seen the one in the car. I she was sitting on that thing. Or was it the couch? It was definitely. It was a couch. couch like this. It was a little couch. Yeah, it didn't excite me like that. Yeah. This porn really excites you? Some porn do. What porn? Mm-hmm. It just depends. <laughs> like, yeah. like the nasty, nasty shit. I ain't gonna hold you like. I be watching some shit. Like, even though I haven't done it, but facials excite me for some reason. I don't know. I ain't done it yet. I ain't done it yet though, man. You know, honeymoon. But you know, I don't know. It's something about. It's the submission part to it. I mean, this keeping it one hundred. I this keeping it one hundred. I always paint somebody's face. You fit me, bro. My my. 
really gonna keep it a thousand in this motherfucker. Okay, so I, I know how it is from how I'm thinking in my head from my view. But from a male point of view, how is that for how y'all? How does that look? How Amazing. Is? Especially, especially it. You gotta miss the eye though. You gotta miss so it. Look, I don't, I don't look, like when look, motherfuckers look, be look. trying to go to the like like I ain't gonna lash you know the eye. reason why you made But you know that's why they made lashes. Yeah, lashes, lashes are good. Come catch us. Yeah. Dead ass. Yeah, that's what la- that's what lashes were made for. Yeah, yeah. Do your research. Seventeen seventy six. So when they when they they, were, they used to be called yeah. cum catchers. Come that's catchers. what lashes were made yes, for. Sir. Yes, sir. They were made for for hoes. Mm-hmm. So that's yeah. why they. That's why and they then they, they and then the world just took them as an accessory, but they were originally made for whores. For <laughs> whores. <laughs> Is that why niggas like they bitches natural? The one that yes. Yeah, but, yeah. Yes. <laughs> At least for me, yes. Yes. Yeah. I be looking yes. like a Siamese cat when right. I got no fucking ass Look, man, look, look. I don't give a fuck. Girl, like, it ain't your movie. It's your movie. You know what? Shut up. <laughs> but see, so don't no porn excites you. Yeah. What porn okay. excites you? I just gave one example. Um, if, if I'm for some quick, probably like a big black one. I'm the BBC, big, you got, got big, the BBC. What's yeah, your search? Big, Ebony big, BBC. Big, yeah, hey, big, 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 like, black. yeah, and it gotta be black. You like no, no, I don't like pink dicks. Yeah, it that shit is big. not attractive, but it gotta be big. Okay, I gotta see the veins. So on you that. you gotta see the veins on that motherfucker. Would you do an orgy? I have to be, um, maybe on some drunk shit. Like, what's so crazy? My nigga asked me to take him to trapeze. Let's do it for his birthday. <sighs> but I said, "Are you really like ready for that?" I get what you thinking is in your head, but are you ready for us to walk through somewhere? Lingerie, box, whatever. It ain't a lingerie, and, and in a white see through tarp. No, it's you could do lingerie or boxes, but you got to be close to as close, or you can be naked. You got to be as close to naked as you can. But I said, Are you ready? I get what you see in your head, but are you ready for it? They're gonna goddamn grab me. Like, let me, you feel me? And he, he started rethinking that shit. See, see, men think about it one way. Yeah, you see, y'all just thinking going in and fucking a bunch of bitches, but. You it's having niggas in that. Too. Yeah, you feel me? You don't think about now, it. We in this motherfucker you know, too. You know, you know these niggas is looking. So if a nigga just got down, you gonna you gonna spaz or you gonna be like, yeah, all right. And the point of being right. in those type of situations it's is the, <laughs> the group of people <laughs> thinks that everybody is on one accord. So motherfuckers think that I'm you with it. Where you bitch at? Where you bitch at? You here alone? No, it ain't going. I ain't going to that. See, it be the white man for me that be wanting to watch black men fuck their wives. And you know, niggas be getting paid up like too. They be paying, paying, they got that, they got that rest of their I mean, but let's get on Sophia Gray. Let's not. Let's get on Sophia Gray. Let's not. Y'all seen that, y'all seen that nigga that got changed by the police? Uh, I did. I did. And he so happened to be the cousin of the founder of yeah. Black Lives Matter. Yeah, yeah. So, so do you, you know, think that was crazy. an accident or intentional? I think that was I intentional. Think I think that was a sin That shit was intentional. I think that was a sin of That was LAPD. That shit was intentional. You niggers stand your place. I so happened to watch the whole fucking video. And not once did that man resist. Mm-hmm. And y'all trying to tell a man to, to stay still that's getting tased. Right. With 70 volts are better. Because them police tasers is different than the little weak ass tasers we can buy. You seen, yeah. him, you seen him do his last little exhale. His nigga, you seen the AirPods fly out the nigga ear. Oh, yeah, I seen that shit too. That shit, that shit. I was like, damn. And then nice. what's so crazy, he was telling me, folk, y'all trying to George, George Floyd, Floyd me. He was saying, y'all trying to kill me. That's gonna be the next thing on the TV. Cause bro, bro fucked around and put, put his knee on the This real. summer about to be crazy. That's why he fucked around and did the did, uh, little gator roll. But what's so crazy <laughs> is, roll. this how it's starting remember here. Remember when, remember when the George Floyd happened? 
that shit was everywhere. You seen that shit every day. I feel like this isn't as national because it's LAPD and they used to motherfucker. They used to LAPD doing that shit. Like LAPD been. But this shit came out on body cam. Like fuck all that. That shit came out on y'all footage, bro. Which means only way to have access to that is if somebody inside leaked that shit. Mm -hmm. Or if that I don't even think it got leaked. Once the whoever cousin found out, bro, you gonna release these tapes. You Mm -hmm. get what I'm saying? My cousin is dead by the hands of LAPD, and so happened. We ain't seen no other like cell phone videos of this shit, but like, cause folks is so used to LAPD beating a nigga ass. Like that's you niggas walk by on that one. Like niggas. But really, my whole thing is the man wasn't doing nothing wrong. All he was trying to he do. He got into an accident get some help. and asked y'all for fucking help. That was it. So I got killed for asking for, for help. For asking for help. That's it. That's literally. Bullshit. That's Literally, bullshit. something has to be done about that. The George Floyd incident was also an accident report. See, but that one was deeper. George, the the main, I forgot the motherfucking name, but the the main white man with that military cut, George Floyd was was fucking one of his ex, one of his exes, which was the white girl. He been had it out for George Floyd, but that wasn't his first oh. run in with George Floyd. He had seen. Him and the girl in the club. So that was some intentional shit. So that was, he been had it out for him on some more so. On oh, oh, duty and nigga, oh yeah, nigga. You more so, you fucking with, you know, white girls like you. you I got this one. But he was fucking with ex. Now that's one reason. I think Person it's some governmental it, conspiracies too, because it's something about his brother, the little ex NBA player. It's something about that nigga I don't like. But neither here that I think his name's Steven something. But it's something about that nigga. I feel like he profited off this shit. But that's neither here or there. But yeah, it was more to that George Floyd shit. Y'all heard Kanye West got married? Yeah. That boy Kanye done got married to a little, little young time. He got him a little. You little just ain't like gonna learn your lesson about marrying white women, though. You ain't saying get out. Yeah, fuck that nigga. You ain't say your last marriage. <laughs> Fuck, you got him a little European model this time or some shit. I ain't gonna nah, 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 have finna have a European European syndrome. Right. But I don't know, I think it's just that Kardashian shit. It's the Kardashian curse. Hey yeah. He's gonna be shit by tomorrow open no more. Hell he t- I heard he turned back to that boy. Not that boy, but Whoa, wait a that minute. Boy. You know, you know, Lamar Odom was on that shit. You know, he, he know he was dope to you. Him. Know you him and, him you and know, you know, he was on that shit. And then the other goddamn Kardashian. Who? The one he was fucking. Chloe? She was not. Chloe was not on that Man. shit. Oh, you, you were thing. not. She, she, she lost a lot of weight, but she was working out. Chloe was not right, on that shit. Right, working out. You lose down that eighty pounds. Right. I don't. I don't. I don't. Sounds like drugs. She, she, lost yeah. a, she lost a lot of weight fast. Nigga said sound like drugs. She did lose a lot of weight fast. But I think most of that shit was stress. And you know, a nigga will stress you. Let's get to yeah. Tristan. <laughs> Tristan was Whoa. stressing her out. Oh. That's her baby daddy name, bitch. That's dr- you know what? Get, get out your motherfucking head. Anywho. Her baby daddy was stressing her out. More reasons to turn to drugs. <laughs> Meanwhile. <laughs> Y'all heard this Florida dude had killed this pastor because he didn't agree with the heaven and hell conversation. What? <laughs> Pick the chips up, nigga. <laughs> that shit was so mind boggling. man is arrested chip. for shooting his cousin, who was a pastor, during the argument over heaven and hell. Niggas is dying over the dumbest shit. Niggas is, I think, you know how your grandma say, you used to say we in the last days 20 years ago. Mm-hmm. We really might be in the last days. Hey, shit, you know the purge started in goddamn Chicago. Chicago been on purge. Nah, bro, you don't, get, purge. you don't get arrested for rape, murder. That, where you see that at? Oh, God. It was, that shit been on. That shit, that shit was. That shit been. been, been I posted that shit when? December? Put that shit in December. 
Now, and, I, know, I know California done got a lot more lenient on a lot of shit. Like, they said, we ain't finna be locking niggas up for this simple shit no more. We got... They sick of that shit. Our jails is overcrowded and shit. We got real things to be saying here. Niggas out here doing 187s and we ain't got nowhere to house them. Fuck. Nah, for real. We got real shit going on and y'all playing. Nah, but... I'm ready for the. It's been a chain of robberies all month. We can't even. We can't even got. We we, we catch one. We gotta hold him and hold himself for for sixty two hours mm-hmm. before transferring to the wayside. <laughs> Man. <laughs> so <laughs> I'm not playing with y'all. <laughs> I don't really know how to play with y'all. Whoa! Wait a minute. I'm hot. What happened? I can't spill. What you trying to spill? Is it the drink? Yeah. There it go. <laughs> what the hell is you trying to spill? Because ain't nobody gonna play with you. <laughs> hey, Diddy, I need a contract, bro. Whoa. Because that don't make no goddamn sense. I see this shit every day. No, but University of App. University of Alabama basketball player. Yeah. Darius Miles. My niggas. Killed his 23-year-old ex-girlfriend. <laughs> she wouldn't talk to him. Because she wouldn't talk to him. Because <laughs> good. Because she, she wouldn't talk to him. But wait. Then. What does he look like? That was on the strip. She look cute. They was on the strip. I suppose he seen her in the car with another nigga. Started shooting at the car. So and originally, I think the nigga was trying to shoot at the nigga, and you end up killing your ex girlfriend. So, mm-hmm. so originally, you were trying to hit that that night and right. fucked around and seen him at a red light and was like, "Oh, you occupied." Oh, 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 that's why. Oh, that's why you not picking. That's why I'm on red. Okay, I'm finna light this bitch up. I but, feel you, bitch. But bro, but, there's a lot of bitch ass in the, in the air lately. Like, mm-hmm. All right, cause he ain't the only nigga that done killed the bitch. Then we talk about the last nigga that killed his ex, cause she was ignoring him. Like, just leave us alone. Hey, bro, I ain't gonna kill her. Y'all be gonna be y'all good, be she's leave really that cute. Like, what be the reason? Why can't y'all leave us alone? That that's what I want. Why we can't leave y'all alone? Yeah. It depends on circumstances. What, why why we, is it so hard? Why are we supposed to leave you alone? For a man to leave a woman alone. It ain't and, hard. Exactly what you said. It's, really, supposed to it's really not hard at all. It just depends on when we want to leave you alone. But why is that? Why do why, we have to wait why for we y'all have to, to be, be ready to leave us alone? Right. Why do we have and to be ready to with y'all shit? That's bullshit. We already put up with y'all bullshit and attitude. And we did. So got that. And we did. Sometimes, you, most of the time, you didn't. Most of the time you didn't. This a cap. Most of the time you didn't. We is not property. What? We is not property. That's cap. That's cap. What do you know? See, it's, that's that Aquarius yeah. shit. <laughs> that Aquarius <laughs> shit. Men look at women. We is not y'all property. You ain't got to be just my property. That's okay. So. Whoa. So clarify. so motherfucker. So clarify that. So what motherfucker can lease to own your bitches. Basically. So, so you willing to share your hoes? We all share them. What you mean? <laughs> <laughs> Break it down. You got, you got to be, you got to be a dumb nigga if you really think you the only one. Boy, you lying. She been having the same side nigga for eight years. And you never know. And more than likely, you do know. She just put, she just put. It. Yeah, this is my best friend from high school. Yeah, yeah, I've been fucking. It's not always true, but nine times out of ten, depending on the relationship. Now, if we, say, every nigga, if we say best friend, every nigga investigates. See, with females, if we say bro, we might have hit you. But if we say best friend, a friend, you really are in the friend zone. You are really in the friend zone because I ain't gonna count. I have a female best friend, and she's real life in the friend zone. Like we we don't go there. Have you ever there. have you ever looked at her differently? No. Have y'all ever fucked? Nope. Have you ever thought about it? Back in the day, but no, it never happened. So we just got over it. Like, fuck it. We or you? We both did. So y'all like, both wanted to fuck. Why didn't you? Mm. Never had time. You Damn. always got time to fuck. Aaliyah turned forty-four today or yesterday. Damn. I ain't know Aaliyah was that happy birthday, Aaliyah. One in a million. But y'all heard they trying to reopen her case. 
Yeah, because yeah, you know Brooke got paid say. 90 million for her deal. Yeah. What? Um, her uncle got she paid both, 90 she million. Was, she, was, she was worth more dead than a But lot of why? Shit. The nigga who put it out, why you take all this time to put that out? You know, goddamn, who, 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 who like, is that? Who is that? Um, it was a nigga who did the end. Um, who did an interview? But who's yeah. her boyfriend? Dame Dash. Dame, yeah. He Dame talks about that shit too. And he, was like, he was like, he was like, bro, got paid ninety million. Now. Like, nobody, nobody wanted to see that about that shit. Hype Williams made her change planes. Like it was, it was. They root. Really they basically, they basically slipped her in the sedatives and made and put her to sleep and made yeah, her get on that. Yeah, I heard that and put her ass to sleep. And I was like, that fucked up. You know, she, she woke up down. Oh, right. God. She woke right. up down. Like, oh shit. Oh, we finna crash. But what was the point? What did anybody gain other than the 90 million? What do you mean? That 90, 90 million got split like five ways. Only five niggas had their hand in that pot. You niggas got paid. You playing? You niggas got paid. I'm finna say, I'm finna say, all right, Kelly got some of it. He was married to her. I'd rather be rich than famous. I don't want to be famous. I mean, I, 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 I definitely got some. And then manifest the take off. We're gonna be famous, but as far as like the shit that you gotta go through to really, oh, I'm gonna just be rich. I ain't gonna be famous. Yeah, like yeah, just get me yeah, rich and well. I ain't gonna care. I get, I get, I get, I get rich nigga money, and I'm doing red carpet shit. I'm thinking y'all gonna see is an Insta story. Y'all ain't gonna see mm. nothing about me, buddy. So, what's your favorite Aaliyah song? My favorite Aaliyah song, off the top of my head, I can't even tell. You. I ain't heard what's your favorite song. Aaliyah song. Cause you really not know Ali a fan, um, but I was a fan fan. Mine personally, at your best. Okay, mine I would say, how could the one I gave my heart to? That one was. That one used to be my shit. Well, I used to hit them little vocals. One of, and the whole one of the million shit was my shit. But how could the one I gave my heart to? Yeah, that was. That was my shit. Cause anytime I broke up oh, with a yeah. motherfucker, how could you the all I gave up to? Yes, that was my shit. Uh, uh, but what? What did what she said? Oh no, please let. Oh, this is my. This jam. is my jam. Well, yeah. But you know that's a. Um, <laughs> Aria did a uh, Aria. Mm. Aria did the best Shout drink at it. Shout out to the drink. Okay, so boom. Do you agree with this? Nigga said the top five coochies you can get. Mm. Mm-hmm. Okay. Single mom coochie. Stay fit coochie. The stay fit is definitely it. The I'm um, celibate coochie. The I'm um, celibate one. Hey, hold on. Is it fresh off celibacy? The wears glasses coochie. Damn. Ooh. And the nice. always got an attitude coochie. Okay. I always so, got an attitude. So number two. And I'm a single mom. So number two is a definite. Number two. I ain't no single definite. single mom. Shout out to that boy Q. You but, feel me? But um. But, but um. What number two, the five, What's the best? What's number the best two coochie? and number four would be would the be the stay fit coochie and the wear glasses coochie. Nigga, nigga. So nigga. what's good about the stay fit coochie? So the thing about the stay fit, right? So it's Cause about, to be honest, on our end, the we're gonna pussy that. We ain't trying to fuck after the gym. It, it, that's okay. That's okay. <coughs> we be so. It's okay. <laughs> it's okay. Cause guess what? Guess what? After you take the shower, I rub your back. You know what I'm saying? Cook you the food. Mm-hmm. You gonna be, you gonna be ready and willing. Gotta after, be good and healthy. You gotta you, be a good and healthy meal. Look, look, Cause she's trying to stay fit. It's, it's okay. I got you. I got vegan. I got vegan recipes. And got them and, and all types of shit. You got vegan recipes. Yeah, I got vegan recipes. Yeah, yeah. You playing? Okay. <laughs> okay. Because I just don't cook with butter. I just. <laughs> I was gonna say it's a lot of shit that I don't cook with. Actually, okay. You gotta, you got them. You, you gotta okay. use different. Uh, you gotta use different oils and all types of We got them. Yeah. So she 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 gonna be ready and then really and truly with a stay fit bitch today is easy to please with the food because all you gotta do is take your ass Zaxby's. You get one nigga that has chicken salads, or you go to goddamn Chick Fil A and cook oh, every oh, every bit that work out. Oh, you ain't go back Domino's. Every before before you go Zaxby's and Chick Fil A. See, stay fit see stay every food. every every, every okay. it ain't that bad. Zaxby's salad don't get you in the game before that Chick Fil A salad though. You yeah. see what I'm saying? The Chick Fil A is on that you see, you see Yeah, Chick Chick. Y'all, really chick, chick, y'all gotta get that done. And I really need y'all to open on Sundays. Because everybody needs the craving for y'all on Sunday morning. And my Please. point right there has been proven for the stay fit pussy on God. Now, for the wet glasses pussy. Now, y'all bitches right here. Let me tell y'all something about y'all. The ones that wear glasses, 
Y'all act like y'all ain't a freak, but y'all the first ones that be willing for a fish. I can believe that. Yeah, boy, like. He's like, they the first ones be willing for a fish. Oh, oh my God. They be, <laughs> they be red D. Ah. Red <laughs> Right here on the forelands. Uh, mm. <laughs> on the forelands. <laughs> mm. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. I might need to give you some glasses. I might need to give you some glasses. Bitch, you wear glasses. Look at all sophisticated and shit. I just want to put you in a skirt and put a book in your hand and be like, yeah. You. What's up? <laughs> okay. All, all right. Escalated quickly. <laughs> So another story I came across. You wear glasses, so those would be the ones. I think I would have made it to this situation to the grave, <laughs> literally. But a girl, she an OnlyFans model, What's and she be that? doing nothing, and she be doing you know her OnlyFans shit with her dude. Okay, cool, y'all make money together. But she said she noticed as of late that during the scenes, her dude be rock hard for the bitches. You get what I'm saying for the other, you know, females who be in a whatever. But when it comes to her in the scenes, like she really be having to do extra work. Do extra because she feel like her well, man don't like be erect you need for her. To spice things up, Shree. Can y'all not really doing other things? Like how much more spicier? Can how you much get? more spicier can you get? You so what get does that? So what does that mean? So when your dick don't get hard for your bitch, but it get hard for all, all the other women. It mean you're not interested in your bitch no more. Could you? Okay. It doesn't Reese. mean I'm not interested in my bitch no more. It just it just it just means that I'm tired of the same basic air routine. Let me tie you up. Okay. So can you still love your bitch but not be but be disinterested in her but not be interested? Can you still love love a female but not be interested in her? Yeah. It's possible. So why would you continue to lead a woman on if you're not interested in her? You love her, but why wouldn't you be? Wouldn't you love her enough to let her go? Sometimes you can't let go. Even if the bitch not interested in you, she just born to you. She don't make you happy, but you love the bitch. Why not just let her know? Love is a very powerful word. Well, I don't know why. It don't. That's a bad word. That's a contradiction. Of- but homegirl, speaking of your nigga, I would, I probably, Fuck number one, I would have that nigga. Cause he don't like you. He don't like you. He don't let that nigga tie you up. Man, listen, some bitches is not into that. Do what you do, do what you do. If you really think he, if you really think he don't love you, let, let him, let him run the train on How is that proving that? Cause the real nigga who love you ain't gonna let nobody run the train on Right. I don't know, that's a lot, because I ain't gonna cap. Every two that have a fancy, you have two dicks, I ain't gonna cap. Every two that had that fancy. I ain't had that fancy. I ain't never had that I done had a lot of fantasies, but, but not that ain't never been one of them. Like, to be honest, I ain't, I done had a lot of fantasies. I don't know, that's fair, sure. But, I ain't had the two dick fantasy yet. But I, I heard, I heard through the grapevine that comes in your 40s. I don't think I'm ready for that check, though. In your 40s? Yeah, because I heard your forties unlocks unlocks a whole different sexual. I guess I'm just be running into abnormal bitches. Sexual. Uh, no, you be running into hoes that been there train train on them since they was twelve. What do you mean? That yeah, you had the point. point. It was normal. It was normal bitches that I know tonight had nothing wrong with them. So called good girls. And they was like, yeah, I want, I want, yeah, 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 yeah I want, I want to have two niggas. Yeah, okay. Bet they do it. Me and my partner ready. No. <laughs> I, so we was watching a motherfucking show. Don't ask me what the name of it was, cause you know. Um, I got a story to show. tell. I got a story to tell. So on boom. I think I told you about this situation. Boom. Girl with her, you know, got her nigga, whatever. Mm-hmm. She felt like she was losing her marriage, losing her man, or whatever. Mm-hmm. She said, if you really want to know if you're losing your man, kiss all his hot spots. And if he don't react to them the same, you know you lost your nigga. I think that's true. Is that true? No. That's true. 
If I kiss on your most intimate spots and you give me no reaction. I'm talking about not a jump, not a not a nothing. And here's why I say oh, that's yeah, true. So, yeah, Cause I'm us as females, yeah. we get that same notion. Like we get like how I knew it was the end of my my last relationship, I didn't want the nigga to touch me. Like even sleeping in the bed together was irritating. Yeah. Was irritating. Like, I remember my sister used to say, I, I used to call her in the morning, bitch, where you at on the couch? Bitch, why you on the couch? I just on the, I, I just felt like being by myself. Like, sometimes it gets to the point you get so irritated. Yeah. Like, you don't, you just don't even want to muffle. Just touch, like, oh, like, like, muffle, what's wrong with you? Nothing. Just, back don't want to be up. around you. Like, back up. But, another part to that story is, she thought her nigga was gay, right? Mm. Because he kept oh, yeah, you tell me about he kept texting these niggas and whoop de whoop. But all the while, he was really just saving all his side hoes under nigga names. Under nigga names. So she ends up giving the man a threesome to see if he gay. Come to find out, long story short, this nigga brought his side hoe. He brought his side hoe in. On the threesome. Is that cheating? Get get into it. Get into it, Cache. Technically, no. No, no, no. Because no. it's not Cause cheating. Because you been fucked this girl. Now, you the agreement was. Here's what the agreement was. Yeah. We're going to go to the club. We going to pick a bitch. Shine us a random. A random. A random. But you tell your side hole to pull up. And you so get that hold of Google it, I. So he can pick. So me. he can pick her. That's cheating. Is that cheating? That's cheating. I, I, if it was a random, it's not cheating. Is that cheating? Because we brought a random to our bedroom. See, yeah. See, yeah, see, yeah see, Paul, y'all answer this. Is this cheating? Is that cheating? If if your girl offers answer you a threesome. If your girl offers you a threesome. What a nigga she fucking. Is it okay? Is it cheating? Is it cheating if you pick a girl you said that, girl you that, already, you that you already fucked? So why I can't have you on my side nigga in? Hello. That we picked out. Hello. That's what you suggested. Hello. <laughs> See now, like, that, that, that's what we do. So yeah. y'all niggas is hypocrites. Yeah. They they double niggas, standard. Niggas, it's, niggas, it's, it's every nigga. Look, it's look, not look, even this one. It's every nigga. nigga. Every nigga yeah, lives by a double standard in some way, somehow, some shape, form. I'm with, I'm with, I'm with. So look, like shit. You, you so you can watch around, another nigga you fuck your bitch. bitch, huh? Can I watch it? Can I watch? Yeah, I'm gonna fuck his bitch too. No, mm-hmm. no, 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 no. If it was a two dick fantasy, and it's you, your bitch, and another nigga, can yeah, you, you watch, watch another him. nigga fuck your bitch? I'm not watching him. I'm, I'm, I'm really focused on my dick in your mouth. The answer is no, ladies the and gentlemen. Is no. <laughs> the answer is the no. The answer is no. But y'all expect us to watch y'all fucking other feet. I'm talking about you be tongue deep, happy, and to that motherfucker. What you mean? We won't go eat a pussy. What you mean? No. We talking no. about fucking. That's the same thing. No. You ain't gonna, you ain't gonna fuck. That's why nothing. any real straight nigga is gonna always say no to a two dicks fantasy. Period. Yeah. I'm not watching none other nigga with you. I'm but gonna say I'm not gonna look at that nigga, period. <laughs> <laughs> So you ain't never ran a train with your homeboy? I most, I most definitely have. How many? Uh, How many? I, just, I can't give you a number. Estimate, 10 to 20 or greater than? It's definitely long, it's definitely more than 20. That's nasty. With the speaking, same hoe or Speaking of definitely hoes? more than 20. Most definitely different hoes. Same niggas? Same nigga. But multiple hoes. So same home, but multiple hoes. So you have y'all just, hey bro, we gonna tag team. Hey bro, shit, it be like that sometimes. You might catch the hoe, I might catch the hoe. Shit, she come to the house, it's over. (laughs) Okay. So let's talk about body count. This why, ladies, you don't go to the trap by yourself. Always (laughs) bring a friend. (laughs) (laughs) Because both of y'all gonna get hit regardless. (laughs) One less body, (laughs) goddamn. But no, one gonna get hit, and while one getting hit. If you smart, if you like the duo, another one gonna be running out of pocket. Hell is you saying? Hey, come on. Yeah. Cause we get but down speaking on, speaking on. Pat, pat. 
it's only, it's, only, it's, only rare, it's only rare. It's only the rare ones that do that. But for all the real, for all the real trap niggas, you know, we we know what we do. Do niggas we give a fuck too. about a bitch body count? No. I don't shit. I don't give a fuck what she had going on for me. It's still the same. It's body count. Hello, say it one more time. It's still feel the same. Every, um, every, is the body every, count every, number even every, important? Is the body count family. number even important? I no. Look, I was we, gonna say something, but I ain't. We all grown. We all done had our whole face. It don't matter if you had it in college or in high school, nigga. Or still going through it. Or still, or some, some of y'all is married, it. still with a whole face. I ain't gonna say too I much. I ain't gonna but hold you, boy. I said what I said. Boy, y'all on so um, too. Yeah, yeah. I better be glad I'm out my whole face, cause probably like a year or two ago, I was on it. I made it. no. I'm on my whole. I'm fucking. What what is your what is your relationship status? Fucking. Heavily. Hey, heavily. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you talking about fucking. Mm-hmm. But I've okay. never thought, I've never thought a body count number really mattered. Because who really, unless you a virgin or just, just started, who really remembers their body count? A I nigga know. who don't get no pussy. I know past high school. A bitch don't get no dick. Right. It's just that simple. Shit. You said you was in your mid fifties in high school. Yeah, yeah, they, yeah. What you mean? I went to I went to seven different high schools. I went to about four, five, six. Yeah, every every different every high school <laughs> every high school you got that new nigga syndrome. Who the new nigga? Is? Everybody. Wait, what's happening, bitch? You know what? What's happening, bitch? I right, everybody, street. everybody, everybody. What's happening? Fuck the new boy. What's and new, and new, but see, but new girls they'll hold that pussy a little longer than the new boy. New boy gonna come in that thing just scrum. I'm hitting something, and I gotta hit y'all in my class so she can tell her friends. And then I'm finna hit her friends, and now down the line I'm fucking the whole goddamn class. <laughs> That's Within my first two weeks of school, like shit, and then I already know I'm good. I'm good for four months here. Get us off to another. <laughs> now off to another. Yo, catch y'all in a minute. What? Shout out to Atlanta promoters. Why eleven forty five? Goddamn. Yeah. <laughs> shit yeah. made the shade room. Yeah. Why that? Why that flyer made the shade room? Hold. Now shout I out seen to the post. That, happy birthday, Martin Luther King. But I seen the post that said Martin Luther King did not die. For him to be on the flyer with some big booty hoes, cause he did. Cause he had Cause he had that we was all gonna be in the club shaking that ass together. But Rosa Parks on the hookah though. Listen, she they sat on that bus they, long they, enough. She they had Rosa stressing. Park. They had Rosa Park on the hookah in the back. <laughs> Call me Rosa. Mark. I wonder what his family be feeling about this shit. Yo, like, I know y'all are probably laughing and crying all at the same time. I don't know if I'm disappointed or happy. Uh, right. It, it was a shot that walked in my job and she was related to Rosa Parks and what funny she actually looked like. You know what? We were funny. We were like, damn, man. Get fucked, man. She did. And we still look like. But you know, they just unveiled the statue at the King Memorial. It, it depending on the angle. Now, now, mind you, all due respect, it's the embrace of Martin Luther King Jr. and Coretta Scott King. It's their little embrace. Why did you make a statue or memorial with an embrace without the motherfucking heads? I don't know, but I don't understand art. Art is art. But depending on the angle, on one angle, it looked like the scene from Baby Boy where he had Tyrese in the motherfucking shit. On so you didn't see my story. On one angle, it looked like a nigga eating coochie and he grabbing them cheeks. I swear to God, I done looked at this shit on all angles. On one angle, it looked like a braised chicken wing. On one angle, it looked like, on one angle, it looked like, it looked like a braised a braised chicken wing. But hold on, look, y'all so, going? So oh, I did see this. I thought it was a dick. Yeah, on one angle, it looked like. Oh my mama! Right, so it's just like. The the artist's name, um, Hank Hank Aaron or something, but it it is it's giving chicken wing to me. It's but giving the, mama. <laughs> no, mama. it's giving that thing was wet. You feel me? It's giving <laughs> so a nigga eating some good coochie. He, he it giving he had Coretta thing. He had them clappers palmed in his hand. You see what I'm saying? He was all in that thing. He oh damn! Then Miami and Kate and Kayla B got into a fight. No, that's her homegirl. Kate and Momo keep fighting. Vaughn's sister and Kate keep fighting. Like, after I done fought 
you three times, bitch. I'm All tired. right. I'm tired. I don't want to fight no more. Like, one no more. Bitch, we going to hit every time I see you, bitch. But that's what they be on. You said that. That's what they be on. We're going to hit that's every time shit. I see you. Let me see. They fall. You can see the Yeah. Video. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. They. And then the bitch, after she beat her ass, smiled in the mugshot. You want to get your ass beat again? But, but I grew up this one girl. She lost every fight, but that bitch kept fighting. That was her whole thing. Her name was Ann. Shout out, Ann. But, baby, mm-mm. When I say every time we heard the word Ann got into a fight, we know she lost, but we it eventually, that bitch just got hard. Because I'm not going to keep my It's like, fight. if you know you can't fight, shut the fuck just, up. Right. Just but that be the, the ones who go Y'all be doing guns. too much. I remember I beat up this girl, and I ain't got no beef with you. I, sh- I fought shot it twice. Twice in the same day. In the same day? In the same day. In the same day. You good, bro? And she still uh, wanted to fight. Trying to find her. She don't want to Now she want to be my friend. Uh-uh. Like, you remember me? I remember I beat your ass. You know what? Shut up. <laughs> I remember I got in trouble for whooping oh, that ass. Man. What? Hey, do go at the head rock. It do, don't it? It look just like the baby boy headlock. And now I don't understand art. And some people, some people is chomping off the people who don't understand art. I get, art, I get, you know, art is art, but no, that look like a chicken wing. It look like a headlock, and it look like a nigga eating some good coochie, palm in the meows. I'm sorry. Sweet yams, <laughs> sweet yams. Period. Sweet. Show me the way. <laughs> Cause I can't. <laughs> That's that Hennessy. That's that Hennessy. Balls <laughs> deep. Balls deep. I was telling my sister about that Hen- oh, that, that Hennessy last night. The vet said, "You know what? I'm finna get, I'm finna get out the room. I have never, y'all know, I drank Delion. I'm a tequila motherfucker. She get but baby." I done heard all the songs about the, you know, the Hennessy Nights and the Henny Dick and all that good stuff. But I've never experienced it. Mm-hmm. See, the full experience is both of y'all got to be on Hennessy. See, if one on, if he just on Hennessy, bitch, you going to get your back blown out. So you got to even the motherfucking score. Both of y'all got to be on Hennessy. And all I'm going to say is, unless your nigga fuck like a porn star, don't do that shit, so. Don't do uh, that. Don't yeah, do that. Yeah, Don't do that. Both of y'all fuck fuck like a that. Star. You won't I'm have no walls fun. in the morning. You're not going to work. You're going to call out. Just soak in the tub. Fuck all that. Cap, cap full of vinegar in the tub. Shit, yeah. Man, look. Psh, fuck all that. So I'm not going to work in the up. morning. I'm just saying. Ain't no coffee going to help me. Ain't no blunt going to help me. Fuck that. That's all I'm saying. It made both of them. He know. Fuck that. See, I ain't going to cap. I'm one of the niggas that fuck like a porn star. She got down. With or without uh, the Hennessy. With or without it. So, 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 so your bitches just need to drink Hennessy just to match your mom. Yes. You really just need to stay hydrated. I'll just stay hydrated. Because <laughs> goddamn. Oh. You're going to oh, need that's, some that's water, thing. juice, fruit. Pedialyte. This <laughs> nigga said Pedialyte. You, you need, need some fruit. Like. You need some fruit. Oh, okay. That's Mangoes. <laughs> and on that note. Maybe a pregnancy test. Plan B. Little plan B or two. You know. <laughs> Ain't nice. Just go the cheap route. Buy, buy a pregnancy test and pop it up. It's a plan B. You know what? <laughs> it is. Do we need to put that? No. I got a whole it video is. of it on my phone. It's, it's pregnancy test with plan B? Yes. I was gonna say we need to come up with it. Ain't no, it ain't no. Is it? It's all of it. It's already all. It's in there. It's in every. Break word. that bitch open. Okay. Oh, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Wait a minute. Pre- wait a minute. Pregnancy test and plan. All of them now? Every one of them. Look, look, I can show wait, you. Wait, wait, when did they start that? They been did that shit. Tip we top. just not hit to it. Tip top. Any white girls been doing that shit for years. So, so which one you take first? The plan B or the pregnancy test? Both. Both. At the same time. Same the same. Well, so, if it come up positive, you'll be negative. It might be an more. abortion pill, though. Why you? But they did say that they were going to start selling abortion pills at CVS. I did see that. I did see that. Yeah, I was taking away the clinics, but CVS said, oh, "Come how that child was still got I you." I think I did it. Like, I think I, go, I think I was gonna Facetime somebody. Oh, that's a new one. Trying to push you down, trying to push you down. I did that. I did that shit on Facetime. I took it. I took it apart every time. Hmm. Yeah. All right. Uh, let me see.
Sit. Sit today. And, if, and, and, if, you, if, you, you know, and for the ones who don't know, you go, the first response. The clear one and the goddamn and the pink one, motherfucker. You oh, know, you know, you know the pregnancy test ain't better than no, that. No, look, I bought, I bought all three of them just to see if it was in all three of them. Mm-hmm. And it is. Mm-hmm. It is. It's in mm-hmm. all three of them. Mm-hmm. The clear one got a brown pill. The first, the first response got a white pill. And the other one got a motherfucking, it looks like both oh. of them put together. I so you know. So you I just, know. hey, man, look, man. I, I did an experiment. Have you ever, while you experiment, have you ever took one of them gas station pills? Tell the truth. No, nah, hell no. Nah. You ain't never took, you ain't never took one of them gas station I pills just, for, just for experiment. I don't, I don't need one. I ain't gonna cap. If I take one of them gas station pills, I really think I'm gonna I'm kill a bitch. <laughs> I'm gonna <laughs> kill a bitch. I'm gonna kill a bitch. Shut up! I'm gonna kill a bitch. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> what did Kevin Gates say? I'm gonna get tired. <laughs> and on that note, <laughs> it's another one. Shout out to the squad and shout out to the mall and shout out to We Good Podcast. Shout yeah, out to no. the Already. Shout out to that boy Q. <laughs> shout out to that boy Q. <laughs> I'm still tripped off the fact that it's, you know all the motherfuckers. I, I know. It's another one. It's your girl, Southside One, honey. The Navy with all the flavor. That's Kelly Cash with a K because she like it her way. And that's Big Greedy. Baby, baby. Big, big. <laughs> 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 you know what else? Oh, oh, no. You hear my knee cheek? Baby, baby. One of the building who know every pregnancy test out there. And we are. <laughs> hey, oh, you talking about? I'm sure man around, but I will take you over. <laughs>